You, my friend, are a riddle to me. Because I've run your face and your prints through every database we have. You know what we found? Nothing. So, why don't we start with your name? 47. 47 is trying to either uh, obtain or protect or get rid of a target in the form of um, a young woman called Katya. And we're not quite sure at first why, but then it transpires that Zachary Quinto's character seems to also want to get a hold of this target. So there's a, a collision of, of kind of a cat and mouse thing happening. Um, and we realized that actually the target was far more complex than we at first thought. Pretty crazy, huh? I just remember reading it for the first time and being really, um, I, being really impressed with how they dealt with the female lead of the film and, um, and the kind of journey she goes on and the human aspect of it. The thing that I really responded to about the movie early on was the idea that the, the, the creative team wanted to take that video game adaptation action genre and populate it with characters who were a little bit more complex and dynamic than you might expect them to be. If there's not something that the audience can relate to in some way um, then and empathize with, then I think it isn't as compelling to watch. Run! Move, move, move! Look out! You're inhabiting something very kind of iconic. I mean, this is classic tie and suit and head and barcode and guns and all of the rest of it. And I wanted all of them to feel homogenous and a part of the character rather than kind of tacked on the top. My character is a peripheral element of, of that world, so I didn't feel the same drive to play the game like Rupert did, which I totally understand, and I'm sure if I was in his position, I would have n never stopped playing the game. I really played them a bunch because I wanted to try and immerse myself in the world that had been created for this guy. And also just to see how he moved in different scenarios. You know, it's very interesting to control a guy with a controller and see that some very talented video game developers had really thought about the way he moved. Things have come a long way from just walking or running, you know? Run! We're gonna burn this program to the ground. You know, you meet Katya and she doesn't seem that at ease with who she is. And I think that I've definitely felt like that at points in my life. And I think that lots of people have. And sort of, you know, on a very universal, general spectrum, um, embracing who you are with all your flaws and your strengths, you're kind of your best version of yourself. I don't think you need to have played the game to watch this film. There's no, there's no kind of prior knowledge needed. It's a very sleek, stylish, um, gritty, European action film um, with uh, I think a great anti-hero at the center who you're not supposed to love but I think maybe kind of do in spite of yourself.